Prince William will have to fund Prince Harry and Meghan if they return to the UK. If you are new here, please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel. Thank you previous reports have claimed the Duke of Sussex is desperate to return to the UK after moving to the US three years ago. Prince William may not be in line with Prince Harry's return to the UK because he will have to fund his younger brother's family, according to Daily Mail commentator Ephraim Hardcastle. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex made the decision to step down from royal duties in 2020, marking the end of the many perks that come with being a member of the royal family. Then, the couple moved to the United States to start a new life, along with their young son Archie. The couple welcomed their daughter, Lilibet, shortly after moving with recent reports that Harry is looking forward to returning to the UK, it begs the question of how the royal family will feel. In particular, his older brother Prince William, who could get more than he bargained for if his brother returned to the UK in his article for the Daily Mail, Hardcastle wrote. William, as Prince of Wales who receives £24 million a year from the Duchy of Cornwall, enjoys a dwindling surplus as he eventually funds his children's families. But it will quickly disappear if Harry and Meghan return to the Gilded Cage. William will have to fund their duties and Archie and Lilibet's housing and tuition costs. Prince William inherited the Duchy of Land after the death of his grandmother and his father became king. Now in this position, William's company is entitled to its excess dividends, each year. I in his memoir, Spear, Harry claimed King Charles warned him he didn't have enough money to support him and Meghan when they married in 2018. Mr. Hardcastle added that because of this, William may have to help as the prospect could be too much, for the monarch recent reports suggest the Sussexes are stressing out about the finances last month, the pair released a joint statement with Spotify to announce the end of a multi-million pound deal with the company. The decision was mutually reached, according to their joint statement with Spotify, but reports indicate that Spotify is confused by the lack of content produced by the pair. Since signing the deal at the end of 2020, the couple have released a 12-episode Meghan Models podcast as part of the deal, one that the couple and company say they are proud of. Despite this, the couple still has their agreement with Netflix, with the contract expiring in 2025. To date, the couple has released two series for the popular streaming service, a controversial six-episode docuseries, and a series called Live to Let. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to this channel.